she's incapable of being unscripted. There was a lot of media hype after the Democrat coup that removed Joe Biden and installed Kamala Harris as the Democrat candidate. But the honeymoon is over and there's been a shift and things are not looking so good for VP Kamala Harris. Here's a recent electronic poll of Teamsters. You can believe it or not, Harris is at 34 percent and Trump comes in at 59 percent, nearly 60 percent. That's bad news for Kamala Harris. To this point, do you remember Sean Spicer? He was the former press secretary for President Trump. He was interviewed by Sky News Australia, and here's what he had to say about Kamala's inabilities. Sadly, Andrew, over and over again, we've seen since she entered the race that she gets a pass that no other candidate in history would uh, has ever had before, and I don't think we'll have again. Yeah, Sean, but you know what the problem is with these things? They are very exposing. You've got to be funny. You've got to be charming. You've got to show a little self-deprecation, uh, wit. And all those things, I think, are, well, she can't deliver. And it's a high-risk thing for her to go to. I think that is the bottom line here. And you just put your finger on it. For all these people who think she should be out there doing more interviews, doing more speeches, doing things that show a certain side to her that they want to see... Her staff knows she's incapable of doing it. That's the dirty secret. It was the same thing with Biden, but for different reasons. When people kept saying he should be out there more, he should do town halls, he should do this. It wasn't that the staff didn't know it. They just knew his limitations. And for different reasons, the staff surrounding Kamala Harris knows the same thing. She's incapable of being unscripted.